Hey, how's it going everyone and welcome back. So, there's something that's been on my mind all day today. And that's Homefront the Revolution. You heard me. Homefront the Revolution. Homefront 2, the sequel to Homefront. Homefront the Revolution. Homefront 2. Homefront, 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 Revolution, Homefront. Homefront, Homefront, Homefront. It doesn't matter how many fucking home fronts I say. Home front 2 is still real, and I may sound mad about this, but I'm not. I'm the opposite of mad. I'm so sad. I'm actually really, really happy. I'm the happiest I've been all my life. Okay, well no, the happiest moment of my life was when I got my Camaro. But that's an entirely different story. Homefront 2 is set in occupied Philadelphia, so apparently in Homefront, we lost the war. That, that sucks ass, but it also doesn't suck ass because it gave us a sequel. And that, my friends, that sucks no ass. That sucks no ass at all. Unless, unless you're into that sort of stuff, man, I ain't judging your ass sucking. From what I've read, Homefront the Revolution is an open world game, and I'm going to read a part from... The article on GameSpot about Homefront the Revolution. Our version of Philadelphia is an oppressed, heavily policed environment, said Fasat Salem. I'm sorry if I didn't pronounce your name right, man, if you're watching this video, which is highly freaking unlikely. Anyway, game designer at Crytek UK. As the player goes through each of the different districts, the game is an open world, so you can bounce around between districts. Everything you do, each mission, or side mission, or whatever else, influences the game world, and influences all the civilians who inhabit it. Everything is being influenced by how you approach the game. Okay. Thank you very much, Fasat. No problem, dear Wub, it has been a pleasure. Since our opponents in this game, the Koreans, are so better equipped than us, we have to use guerrilla warfare tactics such as ambushes and sabotages and hit and run stuff. Think of this game as the second American Revolution, because that's exactly what it is. So anyway guys, if you enjoyed this video, if you're excited for Homefront 2, I know I am, I'm gonna get this game as soon as I can get my hands on it, which is when I get this game. So when am I getting this game? <laughs> Whenever I can get my hands on it. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, remember to give it a like. It really shows me some support, and it it helps me make more and better videos because it helps me know that you guys like them, you know? If you are new here and you want to know more about Homefront the Revolution, then just subscribe because I'll be uploading more news videos on this game. Um, and yeah, I'll be seeing you guys later. Peace out, and good night.